I'm going to ask our producer Kelly if State Senator uh, Royce West is able to join the conversation as well. Okay, sir, I believe your mic is on. Uh, okay. You've been in studio with us now watching this from the moment it started. Right. Tell me, your, what are your initial thoughts when you see this? Well, my initial thoughts are is that uh, I was over at the rally and I heard nothing from the speakers that would warrant uh, a, the shooting of police officers. And so it leads me to believe that there may very well be some outsiders that have come in to uh, somewhat disrupt uh, what was otherwise a very peaceful rally in March uh, when I left prior to this incident occurring. Outsiders? Yes. Like? Well, I mean, I don't know who it could be. It, uh, hopefully we will catch the individuals that are responsible for uh, shooting police officers and then find out exactly who they are and what organizations they belong to. Gotcha. What, what was the feeling that you did get when, when you were down there? Like you said, peaceful people sharing messages and... Uh, the, I mean, actually, Heather, the thought, the, the, what I got from it was that individuals were gathering to express their concerns about what, it had, uh, what has occurred in both uh, Baton Rouge and also in uh, the state of uh, Minnesota. Uh, those organizations were encouraging individuals that were there, close to about a thousand people, I think, to join some of the existing organizations that were advocates for uh, equality and stopping police violence. They had also indicated that uh, they would gather in a town hall meeting next week to talk about uh, exactly what the strategy is going to be in order to address this on a systemic basis. I did hear one thing that it made me, after seeing this, I wasn't concerned about it at all at the time, but yeah, you, you were, yeah, right. I was there. We were there about the same time, I think. Right. I saw you across the crowd. There's a, and I think it's just people are angry and upset and want people to do something. There's this stand up, do something. It's time to stand up, don't lay down anymore. And I, I, I wonder if some people that are more, aren't better connected might take that in the wrong way. I don't know. And you're right, it could be somebody who wasn't even there, just wants to Well, it, it, exactly. That, that's exactly what the message was. Stand up, don't take this anymore. And I'm telling people, stand up, don't take this anymore, because black lives do matter. I mean, we saw exactly what happened, and uh, more recently in Minnesota than and also in Baton Rouge. I mean, I don't care what you say. Black lives do matter. You can't tell me that someone, an, an Anglo sitting in the car with his wife, girlfriend, and a baby in the background would have been treated the same way, especially after complying, at least based on what we saw on the videotape, complying to what the, what the, the officer said do. And so people are sick and tired of it. What, what's happening is, is that because we well, have- Well, when they say stand up, you mean do what they're doing, gathering in protest. Well, not only stand, stand up, I mean, stand, I mean no. stand, stand up, stand up means basically take some action as it relates to changing the system from within. I mean, the fact is, is that you don't go out and start shooting and killing police officers. Just don't do that. But the reality is, is that, and as you well know, both of you well know, we've talked about dash cameras, which I put into law in the early 2000s, and then uh, we did the body camera legislation last session. We're beginning to see more of it, in, in the video, and in terms of what is occurring and what generations of African Americans have said has been occurring in the past. We're beginning to see these things happen now and especially the, the, the generation, the millennials, now they're seeing it, and they want something done. And I think it's gonna turn into more, hopefully, voter registration, hopefully more activism as it relates to going